spectrum now. It's the 100 freestyle for men in the S9 class. Swimmers with uh, minimal disabilities. You see leg amputees, arm amputees mostly. Thomas Tok in lane two. And it's Jose Maria Alcaraz, Spanish champion, the European champion. Next to Australia's most successful Paralympian ever, Matt Cowdery, the world record holder, 55-3-0. And the only man that really can challenge him today, the only two men, were probably his teammates, Rowan Crowther's uh, one, a very young man, he's come through. And the 400 champion from London, Brendan Hall, may well challenge him. Skaluk from Russia and David Grasha from Portugal complete the lineup in seven and eight but the Aussies will be hoping for a one two three here Matt Cowdery world record holder will be the favorite Rowan Crothers the young man who's just come in I think he's just 15 years of age it's his first major championship a man in lane number five Matt Cowdery could be worried about the youngster the young whippersnapper coming up against the champion Matt Cowdery's a fighter though the three hats of Australia in four, five, and six. Blue hat of Spain in lane number three, the European champion. Can he challenge the Aussies? Great start from Matt Cowdery. What a spring off that block there. Really showing his intent. Wow, what a start there. Head and shoulders ahead of the rest already, Matt Cowdery. Well, it really, really was a blistering reaction time. The electronic scoreboard shows 0.62 of a second to get his full body away from that starting block. It wasn't just the speed off the block though, he was fast underwater and fast into his stroke. He's fast at the turn in 26-76. It's Cowdery, Murray and Tot in first, second and third. But watch out now, there's just 28, 29 metres to go. Cowdery though pulling through once again. The field was closing down. He went to sleep a little bit, but he's moving again ahead of the rest of the field. A full body length clear. Matt Cowdery coming away. He is going to retain his title. Matt Cowdery, can he challenge the world record? 55-3-0. Oh, just about 3-100 outside the world record. What a swim from Matt Cowdery. He dominated there from start to finish. He is the world champion. He is the champion supreme from Australia. The European champion Alcaraz from Spain gets in for the silver. And the youngster, Rowan Crothers from Australia, will take the bronze. 57.17 for Crothers, 56.52 for Alcaraz. But Cowdery, what a start that was. What a start it was. And it wasn't just the reaction, as I mentioned, in the super slow-mo pictures there. You could see how he entered the water a metre clear of the rest of the field. His fingertips piercing the waters. He entered the waters and did some very strong dolphin kicking and in a very, very streamlined fashion. Great power generated from the middle of his body and he was up and away. I wondered whether he went to sleep at around about the 65 metre marker, but uh, I'll certainly give him the benefit of the doubt. 300 of a second away from the world record. It was probably the angle of the camera that made the field look like they were closing down on him and then did he get extra speed no he didn't it was perhaps the angles and he chased down the world record but just missed out but a gold medal and